Dance is one of the most primordial of all of the art forms, which means, of course, that it's really, really old. <laughs> Cavemen would often dance in a celebratory fashion after killing something terrifying, like a saber-toothed tiger, or having intercourse with their cave wives, probably. Doggy, I'd imagine. And then since the cavemen, every subsequent generation of humans has added their own dance styles and dance moves into the Bible of Boogie. Waltz, rumba, Elvis pelvis, popping and locking, Saturday Night by Wigfield, Gangnam. And now you can add one more onto that list. Mine. I've called the dance up is down and black is white. The first part of the name, of course, refers to the fact that during the dance, I'm pointing both upwards and downwards simultaneously and at the same time. This calls into question our entire notion of up and down. I mean, is up truly up? And if so, are all Australians wrong? at this particular thing, not in a general, wider context. The second part of the name, of course, simply refers to the quality of the dance. I myself am a phenomenal dancer. It is a gift I have had since birth. But I'm white, and normally a phenomenal dancing ability is something associated with, them. Um, well, people who are African-American, urban, black, 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 mobo nominee, people who are black. <laughs> what genre would my dance fall into? Well, that is a great question. Thank you so much for that. Um, I would say it would be like if disco dance and hip hop dance had a baby uh, and then that baby grew up in Japan and grew up kind of gothy like steampunk, kind of gothy, like cosplay gothy. Uh, and as that, that baby uh, grew into a, a human adult being, she met a lovely guy, worked in TV uh, production side. People kind of warned her about him because he had a bit of a temper. Um, and she did sometimes see him exhibit that temper with other people, which obviously she wasn't, you know, over the moon about, but he, he was always fine with her. So it didn't really seem like something that she could make a big deal of. He wasn't Native American himself, but he was quite into the whole kind of Native American culture. Uh, so a lot of a lot of feathers, a lot of uh, dream catchers. The relationship progressed. He proposes, she says yes, and they got married uh, in a kind of a science fiction themed wedding, dressed uh, as like um, kind of retro, uh, like 60s TV show space people with like shiny suits and like big crazy wigs. I kind of feel like this is the dance that could be done at that wedding reception. Yeah, that genre. My humble hopes and dreams for... For this particular dance are that tomorrow up is down and black is white is as synonymous with the disco clubs as rubbing your genitals on the genitals of somebody who you find attractive enough is today. Fingers crossed I can bring a little bit of art to the discotheque. Sweet, now that.